Well, hello, thank you for joining me today again on the Church History Trail. And we find ourselves again in Dungannon. And where we are now is actually just at the monument here for the war dead. And it's a pretty good monument that you can see. Just seeming to let you see it. And it's for the Great War. And I'm going to read the wee inscription out to you here. It says, just seeming to let you see it. It says, in memory of the soldiers and nurses of Dungannon who gave their lives for freedom and humanity in the Great War, 1914 to 1918. And that's actually for the Royal Anniskillen Fusiliers. If you can see that. And so that's the, the war memorial in Dungannon. And as you can see there, that's the Hill of the O'Neill and Ranfurly House, which is the museum. So this part here is actually the visitor center, which is actually a museum. And it's a, a quite good museum because I have been in it. And that building there then beside the museum is the old police station. And if you remember, I showed you that in an Orby video, at least the back of it. And so this is now the front of it. And so we'll take a wee walk up here and we'll have a wee look. And there's not too many about today, which is good. Sometimes it's hard to get filming when there's a crowd about. So it's, when there's not too many about, it's easier to record. And so this is the museum or the visitor center. As you can see. Hill of the O'Neills and Ranfurly House Arts and Visitor Centre. And it's a great wee museum. It's closed today, so I can't take you in, but we can maybe have a wee quick look from the glass. As you can see, So that's the entrance to the museum. There's an upstairs as well in the building. It says here, Hill of the O'Neill, Ranfurly House Arts and Visitor Centre. And it was opened, oh, it was opened by, officially opened by First Minister Peter Robinson and Deputy First Minister uh, Martin McGuinness. And of course, Martin McGuinness is now deceased. And it was opened on the 21st of October, 2012. And so I'll show you the old police station. You can see the the wire. Of course, that was for a familiar scene with all the police stations. And it was to protect from missiles coming in. So it was to protect the building and the people inside. But that's the, uh, that's the front of the police station. Or at least what used to be the police station in Dungannon. And it's just a pity that that's not turned into a museum. But sometimes with the climate here, with the climate here, and and uh, and I'm not talking about the weather. I'm talking about political climate. Sometimes it's not practical. There, there's a Garda Shikana museum down in Dublin, and it, so it would be great if if they could turn in this here into a police museum. But I don't see that happening, to be honest. <laughs> But there you go. Certainly enjoyed the one down in Dublin. And so that's the old police station. And so thank you for joining me today again on the Church History Trail. And again, if you enjoy the channel, please like and subscribe. God bless.